So in this very short video, I want to show you how easy you can perform and use deceptive techniques uh, and distract the attention of the uh, people. It's like a, the magician that is performing a trick and is taking the attention of the public in another uh, part so he can perform the trick. The criminal individuals are doing very often this. This video is especially for our brothers that are working like all law enforcement or security personnel to understand that not all the time what you are seeing is also the reality. So for this particular video, I'm using a training gun. Uh, even if it's a training gun, I will try to check it again to clear it. No magazine inside, inside the barrel, chamber room, no bullets. So all is okay. Why I'm checking it even if it's a training gun? I'm checking it because I'm training my brain when I will have all the time a gun in my hand to be able to perform the same safety and security measures so I don't have incidents. So I am positioning the gun inside the waistband, like in this position, like many of the, I don't know, uh, uh, local uh, gang criminals and so on are doing. They don't have holster and so on. I am positioning here. Let's say it's existing a, a police uh, control. Of course, if the police officers are respecting 100% uh, their procedures, it, this cannot happen. But if it's happening or it's a security uh, checkpoint or I don't know what kind of uh, thing, if he is put it to put the t-shirt many times to put the t-shirt up in such a way to show what he has on him on, or, or, or if the, uh, the waistband he has different kind of weapons, you see that this is a subcompact weapon, so it's very easy to conceal. It's not dragging attention. So if he's putting to put the shirt up, what is the technique? Basically, he's catching, he's going with his hand up more uh, faster down. This is the hand that is dragging attention, catching the shirt. So it's seeing that he's catching the shirt. The other is covering, coming on the gun. The last two fingers are catching, or maybe you can catch it also with this one from the lateral in such a way that when this is catching and you go immediately with them up, stretching is not seeing anymore. It's looking also down to see that you, he don't have nothing. And then he's twisting to show you the back or you say to twist. And now he has him prepared the gun when he's twisting to sh shoot. What is happening here? If he has bullet on the chamber, of course, even if it's catch here, he can shoot the first bullet. The second, because of the cloth, is possible to have malfunction. But the first bullet, it will go. If he has a revolver, then it will not have malfunction because it's uh, his uh, principle of working. It's based on other uh, type of motion. So he has this cy cylindrical uh, uh, round. Uh, I don't know in English now how he's saying. So from the revolver, so it cannot hear the motion of the gun is coming back the slide. So if you have an obstacle or something, the first will fire and the second is possible to not trick anymore the second bullet. But the revolver, revolver it will uh, move continuously so you don't, don't have incidents of fire. So very easy yeah, to understand that they can use, and not like me, I'm not trained to make this I'm not making this uh, like my daily training, but these guys, the criminal individuals are repeating this very often and they will make it in such a way that you don't catch it. So it's going ahead, they are going with the both hands, taking up, showing you also the back and now it's ready, especially if he has a revolver to shoot. Yeah. So very, very careful of the motions that the people are doing because not all the time what you are seeing is the reality. 